and the Clare Camogie coach, uh, Ger O'Connell, rang me. And I remember when he rang me and I was like, look, Ger, like, I think you're ringing the wrong person here. Like, I'm inclined to be useless to you. I haven't even had surgery at this point. He said, no, did you know, there's more important things than being on the pitch. Like, you'll have a really good influence in the background and we'll get you doing things as the season goes on. And I think it was about a week after surgery that I went to the first training session. And from then on, I... I didn't miss a huge amount of trainings in the whole year, a huge amount of matches. I don't even know if I missed any, but Mm -hmm. it was just that accountability to be there. But it was different from the training accountability because coming to training is fine, but you actually have to push yourself in that session. So Mm -hmm. that was just getting me, making sure that I was meeting people in the week and doing anything that I could while I was there to help. As I mentioned, probably wasn't much. (laughs) I was there anyway, but it was great because each week, like I said, when you're planning it, if I had nothing to put in other than work, it would have been a very long year. Whereas when you have these days, you know, might be two days, might be three days, it's keeping you ticking over and it's keeping you doing something and it's keeping up meeting your friends and seeing people on a regular basis. 